Hey, what's up, guys? We've got uh, Big Six here for you today. Christy Mathewson starting for the Giants against the uh, Phillies, and uh, it'll be John Titus starting this off for uh, Philadelphia. Um, and uh, the rule for Titus is a 66 for a zero, and uh, his second rule is a 56. It'll be a six, and he gets a double over to right center field, and that'll bring up Kitty Bransfield with the runner on at third base. Nobody out top of the first. Bransfield rolls a 16 for a 28, so a little ground ball over to shortstop. Bridwell has it, throws to first for the out, one away, and here's Mickey Doolin. Mickey up there uh, rolls a 25 for an A. That's going to be a single over second base. That'll score the runner, one nothing for the Phillies right away. And uh, let's see what happens next. So it is uh, Eddie Grant up there, and he rolls a 42 for a 13 and strikes out. Two down. Sherry McGee now, who rolls a 33 for a 2. Man, look at that. He gets a 2, and that's a triple along the right field foul line, and uh, he winds up at third base. That scores the runner. 2 nothing. and Matthewson running into some problems here already. Fred Osborne rolls a 23 for a 32. It's a fly ball over to right field, and it's going to be Donlin there for the catch, and we go to the bottom of the first. But the Phillies have uh, struck already. Roger Bresnahan rolls a 16 for a 26. It's a ground ball over to Knabe at second base. He makes the play, throws to first for the out, one away. Mike Donlin up there now. He'll roll a 24 for a 13, and there's a strike over George McQuillan. Two outs, and it's Spike Shannon. Shannon rolls a 43 for a 29. That's um, going to be a ground ball back to uh, McQuillan, who throws over to first for the out. And uh, we will go to the top of the second. It's Otto Knabe up there hitting 212. Phillies, uh, bottom of the order, just like everybody else, doesn't have much going for it. He rolls a 25 for a 9, and that's a strikeout. One away. Red uh, Dewin now, the catcher. Rolls a 23 for a 32. It's a fly ball over to Donlin and right. He's got it for the out two away, and it's George McClellan. George rolls a 31 for a 36. It's changed to 40. That's going to be a foul. Next roll is a 34 for a 44. It's a fly ball over to center field. Seymour is there and has that for the out. We go to the bottom of the second inning. It'll be Fred Tenney here. He's hitting 308 so far in the season. Tenney rolls a 62 for a 12. And uh, this is uh, paused a little bit. We'll have to uh, give this a second. There it is. Uh, that 12 means that's a uh, ground ball over to the first baseman, uh, uh, Bransfield, who flips over to McQuillan, covering at the bag for the first out. One away. It's Art Devlin now. Art rolls a 21 for a 30. It's a fly ball to left field. Shannon has that for the out. Two gone. Al Gridwell now. He rolls a 31 for a 9. It's a strikeout. We go to the top of the third inning, and it's John Titus up there. John rolls a 26 for a 27. That'll be a strikeout. Number three for Matthewson. One out, and here is Katie Bransfield. He rolls a 16 for a 28. That's a ground ball over to the shortstop, Bridwell, who makes the play and throws the first for the out. Two away, and it's Mickey Doolin. Uh, shortstop up next. He's hitting only 167, and uh, he rolls a 54 for a 45. That's a fly ball over to right field. Donlin has that for the out. We go to the bottom of the third. It's Cy Seymour. Cy rolls an 11 for a 0, and uh, his next roll is a 34 for a 6. That'll be a double to right center field. Seymour on second. First hit of the game for the Giants, and here comes Larry Doyle with nobody out. He rolls a 31 for an 8. That's a comeback over to McQuillan. Throws to first for the out. Seymour moves up. One out, and here is uh, Christy Mathewson, who is going to bunt. Infield comes in. The roll is a 66 for 4 for Mathewson. Uh, he probably would have had a home run or something there. Ends up being a bunt back to McQuillan, the pitcher who throws over to the second base, McNabe, covering her first. The run scores, and it's a 2-1 ball game. Here is Bresnahan, who rolls a 54 for 45. And uh, Little E rolls a 66. It's out of the range. It's a fly ball over to right field. And it's going to be the uh, right fielder, Titus, who grabs that one for the out. We go to the top of the fourth inning still now it's 2-1 Phillies and uh, this will bring up Eddie Grant uh, Grant rolls a 13 for a 14 that one's um, pretty clear to you a little bit out angle is not quite so good for me um, and he ends up with two balls on him his next roll is a 35 for a 39 and that's changed to a 23 that is going to be a wild throw by the catcher Bresnahan over to first base after a swinging bunt by Grant so Grant is the runner on at first and here comes Sherry McGee Grant uh, does have an 11, and we are going to play some hit and run with him. And uh, the rule is a 54 for a 45. It's a little fly ball to Dominant and right for the first out. One away. Fred Osborne up now. He will rule a 62 for a 12, and that's a ground ball over to shortstop. Ridwell grabs it, flips over to Doyle for one, and back onto Tenney at first for the double play. And we will go to the bottom of the fourth. Mike Donlin will lead this off. He rolls a 63 for a 31. Fly ball over to Osborne and center for the first out. One away, and it's Spike Shannon up there. Shannon rolls a 24 for a 13, and strikes out third strikeout for McQuillan. Two gone, and it's Fred Tenney, who rolls a 65 for a 35. Little E rolls a 41. That's going to be a pop foul out to Grant, the third baseman, and we'll go to the top of the fifth inning. Here is Otto Knabe, and uh, Otto rolls a 31 for a 14. That'll be two balls on him. 
His next roll is a 34. 4, 44. It's a fly ball over to Seymour in center for the out. One away. Red doing now. Rolls a 55. 4 and 8. That's a ground ball over to short. And uh, Bridwell has that one. Throws the first for the out. Two away. And here's George McQuillan. And Matthews has really calmed down, hasn't he? McQuillan rolls a 26 for a 13. Strike on number 4 for Christie. We go to the bottom of the fifth. And it's Art Devlin. Fast moving game. Devlin rolls a 54. 4, 45. It's a fly ball over to Titus and right for the first out. Bridwell now rolls an 11 for a 7. He gets a single over there to right field, and that'll bring up Cy Seymour. And uh, we'll check on Bridwell really quick. Yeah, we can do some hit and run. That's what McGraw is going to do here. Rolls a 24 for a 13, and that's the last thing you want to see is a strike him out, throw him out after uh, the uh, runner uh, Bridwell started uh, running, and uh, we'll go to the top of the sixth inning. 2-1 still Phillies. And uh, it is John Titus up there, rolls a 15 for an 11. That'll be a single and then a stolen base for him. Nobody out, and Katie Bransfield is up there. This is similar to how this game started. Bransfield rolls a 23 for a 32. That's a fly ball over to Donlin in right field for the first out. One away, Mickey Doolin up there. He rolls a 22 for a 7. That'll be a single that will score the runner. It's now 3-1 Philadelphia, and that'll bring up Eddie Grant. Grand rolls a 31 for a 9. That's another single. And, man, they really teeing off on Matthewson. Sixth hit given up so far by Matthewson. Sherry McGee up there now, who had that uh, big uh, triple. He rolls a 36 for a 33. That's going to be a little pop-up over to the shortstop. Bridwell for the second out. Now it's Fred Osborne. Osborne rolls a 22 for a 7. That's going to be a single. And uh, it will not score the runner. Uh, the runner was slow. And so the putout goes from Shannon all the way down to Bresnahan. We'll go to the bottom of the sixth inning. 3-1 now, Phillies. And here is Larry Doyle. Doyle rolls a 66 for a zero. Second roll is a 45 for a six. And that's a double for him. And that'll bring up Christy Mathewson, who, of course, is going to bunt again. I think it's the obvious thing to do. His roll is a 61 for a 27. That's a pop-up over to the pitcher, McQuillan. And he grabs it and throws over to Doolin behind him for the double play. And so, so much for that. Two outs after one uh, roll of the dice. And here's Roger Bresnahan. Rolls a 41 for a 28. That's a ground ball to Doolin, who throws the first for the out. We go to the top of the seventh. Had to roll my eyes a little bit after that uh, bunt result. Maybe I should have swung away with Matthewson. Uh, Otto Knabe now rolls a 14 for a 43. Fly ball over to Shannon and left for the first out. One away, top of the seventh. 3-1 Phillies. Red Dewing now rolls a 22 for a 7. That'll be a single to right field. And uh, that will uh, bring up the pitcher, George McQuillan, with the runner on at first. And, of course, he's going to bunt as well. The roll is a 52 for a 27. Uh, two uh, strikes now on McQuillan. His next roll is a 24 for a 13. Fifth strikeout for Matthewson. Two outs, and here's John Titus. And John rolls a 35 for a 9. That's another one of those infield head singles. Matthewson hasn't been drilled, but he's been giving up a lot of infield hits. Here is Kitty Bransfield. He rolls a 52 for a 27. That's going to be a strikeout for Matthewson, and we go to the bottom of the seventh inning. Mike Donlin leads things off, and he rolls a 65 for a 35. It's a foul out to Grant, the third baseman, for the first out. One away, Spike Shannon uh, rolls a 25 for a 10. That'll be a single to center field, and that'll bring up Fred Tenney. And uh, that's a 44. Tenney rolls a 44 for a 7. That'll be a single that sends uh, Shannon over to second. One out here, bottom of the seventh. Our Devlin up there, and the Giants have a chance. Devlin rolls a 66 for a zero. This might uh, change this game in a second. And another 66 for a one. Now, let's see if that can be reduced to double. Now it's a 62 out of the range, and that's going to be a home run. And so Art Devlin, with a single swing of the bat, has turned this game on its head. Devlin getting the big blow, the home run here in the bottom of the seventh inning. And uh, that will make this a 4-3 to three game in favor of New York. And I was going to talk all about how the Giants in real life had fallen apart to the Phillies um, at the end of the season. Here maybe the beginning it was going to happen, but boy, I was wrong. Art Bridwell rolls a 23 for a 29. That's a ground ball back to the pitcher, McQuillan, who throws the first for the out, two away, and it's Cy Seymour. Seymour rolls a 15 for an 11. That'll be a single and then a stolen base after that. Now Larry Doyle. Rolls a 61 for a 36, change to a 40, and that's going to be a little ground ball over to second base. Knabe has it and uh, throws the first for the out, but too little too late as the Giants ended up with three off of that massive, massive home run. And we go to the top of the eighth, Mickey Doolin up there. And uh, he rolls a 35 for a 23. That is going to be another uh, swinging bunt and another error on Bresnahan. Two errors in the Giants so far, and that's what's been killing him. Eddie Grant up there now, one for three today, hitting 302. He rolls a 35 for a 39. And that means that uh, the runner, Doolin, is uh, caught trying to steal. One away. Grant's still up there. 
Rolls a 63 for a 30. Fly ball to left field. Shannon has it for the out. Two away. Sherry McGee now rolls a 21 for a 30. It's another fly ball over to Shannon and left, and we go to the bottom of the eighth. Four to three is still the score, and Christy Mathewson leaves this one off. He rolls a 51 for a 23, changed to 36. That'll be a ball. Mathewson working on his uh, fifth consecutive win to start the season. He rolls a 64 for a 13. It strikes out number five for McQuillan. One away. It's uh, Roger Bresnahan who rolls a 66 4 0 and a 13 4 6. That'll be a double to right center, and that'll bring up Mike Donlin. Runner on a second. Donlin rolls a 22 for a 7. That's going to be a single that will score the runner, and that'll bring up Sh- Spike Shannon. My, oh my, how this game has changed. The whole complexion of this game has changed. Shannon rolls a 54 for 45. Fly ball over to right field. Titus has that for the second out. Two away, and it's Fred Tenney. Tenney rolls a 45 for a 14 and walks. First walk given up by McQuillan, and you'll notice he doesn't have any Zs to prevent the walks. And it's uh, Devlin. He rolls a 33 for a 7. That's a single that scores one, sends Tenney to third, and it's a 6-3 to three ball game. We'll just go ahead, and uh, we're going to have to take the pitcher out as Bridwell gets a, uh, another single, scores another run, 7-3 to three now, and that is going to be it for the uh, pitcher here. We're going to put in, I think, Buster Brown. Uh, for the uh, Phillies uh, to try to pitch the rest of this one as uh, that was uh, probably a little bit too much there for McQuillan. He couldn't quite finish this game. 7-3 to three now the score. And Seymour rolls a 53-4, a 16, and that is going to be a fly ball over to center field. Osborne has that for the out finally. We go to the top of the ninth inning. 7-3 to three now the Phillies behind. They should have had this game in, in hand. Six runs for the Giants in those two innings. Osborne rolls a 14 for a 43. It's a fly ball to left field. Shannon has it for the first out. One away, and it's Otto Knave who rolls a 64 for a 13. Strike on number seven for Christie. Two on, and Red Dewing rolls a 23 for a 32. It's a fly ball over to right field. Titus has that for the out, and that's it. Giants improved 11 and 5. And this was an exciting game for a while, but man, New York just completely blew it open there in the bottom of the seventh and then added on even more damage in the bottom of the eighth. And there you have it. Quick game for you. 7-3 to three Giants, final score. And uh, Matthewson is now 5-0. and oh. uh, I will uh, talk with you again tomorrow. Bye-bye.